Lights, camera, chills. Prepare to be frozen in suspense as we embark on a journey to the icy depths of horror cinema. John Carpenter's The Thing stands tall among the pantheon of fear-inducing masterpieces, a bone-chilling experience that has etched its name as one of the greatest of all time. But hold on to your frost-bitten extremities, my friends, because there is news stirring in the cold Antarctic winds. Yes, you heard it right. The Thing, too, may finally be creeping its way towards our shivering souls, bringing with it the promise of solving some of the major mysteries left lingering after the original tale. For those unfortunate souls who are yet to witness this cinematic gem, let me give you a quick rundown. Directed by the legendary John Carpenter and inspired by John W. Campbell Jr.'s novella, who goes there? The Thing terrified audiences in 1982 with its fusion of science fiction and horror. The formidable Kurt Russell led an ensemble cast, including T.K. Carter, Richard Dysart, Peter Maloney, Donald Moffat, Keith David, David Clennon, A. Wilford Brimley, and more. Set in the desolate lands of Antarctica, the story follows a team of American researchers and a daring helicopter pilot as they stumble upon a chilling enigma a shape-shifting creature that can assume the identities of its unfortunate victims. Now fast forward to the present day, where whispers of a long-awaited sequel have reached our eager ears. Speculation has swirled like a blizzard in the dark corners of the internet, leaving fans of The Thing craving answers to questions that have haunted them for decades. Will we finally discover the origin of the mysterious creature? Will the survivors find closure amidst the frozen wasteland? Or will this new chapter unravel a whole new land? layer of spine-tingling enigmas. So, prepare your thermometers, folks, for the anticipated return to the sub-zero realm of terror that may soon be upon us. The chilling winds carry whispers of a long-overdue sequel, promising to thaw the mysteries that have left us frozen in anticipation. As we delve into the realm of The Thing 2, we can finally unravel these secrets that lurk beneath the ice. Will this long-awaited continuation bring us closer to understanding the true nature of the shape-shifting nightmare that first haunted our screens all those years ago. Grab your parka, gather your courage, and join us on an expedition into the unknown. Welcome, my fellow thrill-seekers, to the enigmatic world of The Thing 2. Now, just before we go on our expedition, we have a very small request. If you like our content, please support us by subscribing to our channel. This is just a little click for you, but for us, it means an awful lot. Thank you very much. Now, let's begin. What are the present developments that have left us so excited? Get ready for a thrilling update, folks, because the chilling world of horror cinema is about to heat up. Fans of John Carpenter's sci-fi masterpiece, The Thing, have long awaited its sequel, and it appears that their patience may soon be rewarded. However, director John Carpenter himself is playing a mysterious game with our nerves, adding an extra layer of suspense into the mix. During his appearance at the Texas Frightmare Weekend in 2023, Carpenter was faced with the question of whether Keith David's character, Childs, was truly a thing at the end of the first film. Rather than providing a straightforward answer, Carpenter cleverly hinted that a sequel might be in the works. The anticipation grows as Carpenter teasingly states, I have been sworn to secrecy, okay? Because there may be, I don't know if there will be, there may be a thing too. This isn't the first time that the whispers of a sequel to the bone-chilling classic have circulated. Carpenter himself has dropped hints in the past acknowledging that there are updates he cannot divulge. As the legendary filmmaker wisely expressed, we will see, we shall see. Never say never in the movie business, never say never. The Thing first invaded our nightmares in 1982, led by the resourceful R.J. McCready. Brilliantly portrayed by Kurt Russell, they engage in a desperate battle against the relentless creature that can imitate any form. Initially, the film faced mixed reviews from critics, but has since risen from obscurity to become a revered horror classic and one of Carpenter's greatest achievements. When the original thing debuted in theaters, it faced frigid receptions from negative reviews, earning a domestic gross of just over $19 million against a reported budget of $15 million. However, like a resilient survivor battling against all odds, it refused to succumb to its initial fate. Through the warmth of home video releases, The Thing found solace in the hearts of horror enthusiasts, solidifying its status as a beloved cult classic. With the current trend of legacy sequels dominating the industry, 
The timing does seem right for the return to the frozen world of The Thing. However, one can't help but wonder if a direct sequel might disrupt the haunting ambiguity of the original's ending. Who can forget the iconic moment when McCready and Child share a drink? their icy standoff thawing amidst the looming threat of the shape-shifting horror. It was a finale that left us chilled to the bone in the most satisfying way. Yet, amidst our trepidation, there may be just a glimmer of hope. A 2002 video game featuring a cameo from Carpenter himself served as a sequel to the original's events, delving into the aftermath and introducing new characters. While it may not have perfectly captured the film's magic, it demonstrated that there are still untold stories waiting to be discovered in the frozen wilderness of Antarctica. So, as we raise a glass in homage to the iconic original, let us remain attentive to any further whispers from within the industry. Will the thing too become a reality, or will it remain a frozen dream? Only time will tell. Can the thing too Fix the biggest issue in the franchise. Oh, the sweet scent of redemption is in the air, my friends. It appears that The Thing 2 has the potential to right one of the biggest wrongs in the franchise's history. Let's take a moment to reflect on the tumultuous journey that led us here. When John Carpenter unleashed his remake of The Thing from Another World Upon the World, critics weren't exactly showering it with praise. They scoffed at the gross-out special effects and the unrelenting bleakness of Carpenter's vision. To add insult to injury, the film struggled to find an audience at the box office. But oh, how the tables turned. Over time, like a creature lurking in the shadows, the thing wormed its way into the hearts of horror aficionados. Through repeated viewings on TV and VHS, it transformed from a misunderstood gem to a shining example of the genre's finest filmmaking. We were captivated by the ambiguous ending where McCready and Child sat amidst the wreckage of their Antarctic camp, unsure if one of them was a shape-shifting imposter. It seemed like the end of the line for the story, especially considering the lacklustre box office performance, but oh, how the tides of fate have shifted once again. In a fascinating turn of events, Carpenter warmed up to the idea of a sequel in later years, even revealing that a Dark Horse comic sequel from 1991 perfectly captured the story he had in mind. And now, at the recent Texas Frightmare weekend, Carpenter teased us with the tantalizing possibility that The Thing 2 might finally be creeping its way towards our screens. The suspense is already killing me, but freeze, my fellow horror enthusiasts, for there is a little more to this tale. Let's cast our eyes back to the year 2011, a year that saw a wave of classic horror titles being remade. Among them was a prequel to The Thing which aimed to tell the story of the Norwegian camp seen in the runes in Carpenter's original film. Alas, despite some remarkable practical effects that were tragically covered up with lacklustre CGI, the prequel fell short of capturing the tension and intelligence of its predecessor. It lacked that something special that made the 1982 version a true classic. But not to worry, The Thing 2 has the potential to right these wrongs and reclaim the legacy of the franchise. If Carpenter's involvement is any indication, we might just have a shot at redemption. The 2011 prequel can be cast aside like yesterday's melted snow, and the true story of Childs and McCready after the credits rolled can be explored. Imagine Carpenter himself, the maestro of horror, back behind the lens, ready to deliver a chilling experience that explores themes of mistrust and paranoia, and the timing couldn't be more perfect. And so, my friends, we shall hold our breath in anticipation. The stage is set for The Thing 2 to fix the mistakes of the past, to restore the franchise to its rightful place among the pantheon of horror greatness. The icy winds of change are a-blowing, and we can't help but shiver with excitement. Prepare yourself for a thrilling journey back into the heart of terror. The Thing 2 may just be the sequel we have been waiting for. Every big mystery we seek answers to. In a twist that even the shape-shifting alien from The Thing couldn't have predicted, John Carpenter's long-awaited sequel, The Thing 2, might finally solve eight of the original movie's most perplexing mysteries. The Thing, a horror masterpiece that has kept fans pondering for over four decades, left a trail of unanswered questions in its wake. With the absence of a proper sequel, these enigmas have been haunting fans like an extraterrestrial parasite. But fear not, 
for John Carpenter's The Thing 2 might just be the saviour we need to bring closure to these unresolved storylines. Let us delve into the abyss of these perplexities, shall we? First up, we have the lingering question of whether MacReady or Childs, the two surviving characters, were secretly the thing all along. The film's ambiguous ending left us in suspense, wondering if the alien had managed to infiltrate one of them. But as much as we crave answers, revealing the truth might undermine the very essence of the original film, shaking the foundation of mistrust so carefully woven through the narrative. Next up, we have the burning curiosity regarding MacReady and Child's fate. Did they ever make it back home? or were they doomed to perish in the frozen wasteland? If the Thing 2 materialises, it might offer a glimpse into their ultimate destiny, whether it be a heroic rescue or a tragic demise. Ah, the case of the mysteriously unlocked blood supply. In the original movie, the crew discovered that one of them had tampered with blood samples, indicating that they were the insidious Thing in disguise. The culprit's identity, however, remained a chilling mystery. Perhaps the Thing 2 will lead a new cast back to the Antarctic base and shed some light on this unsolved puzzle. And what of the thing itself? Did it manage to escape the base, leaving behind its frozen prison? With the sequel being a distinct possibility, it's highly likely that the alien is still lurking somewhere out there, ready to sow chaos once again. But wait, there is more. Could the thing have come to Earth accompanied by fellow extraterrestrial invaders? Could there be more things lurking in the shadows, waiting to strike? The thing too might shed light on the true scale of this cosmic menace. One of the most confounding mysteries revolves around the thing's limitations in recreating non-biological materials. We witnessed human versions of the thing wearing clothes, and possessing personal items, defying its supposed inability to replicate such objects. Will The Thing 2 finally expose the truth behind this baffling contradiction? The duration of The Thing's presence on Earth has also puzzled fans. Speculations range from thousands of years to a mind-boggling 100,000 years. Only a sequel can put this debate to rest and reveal the secrets of the alien's extensive stay on our planet. Last but not least, we come face to face with the terrifying possibility that the Thing could assimilate all of Earth within a mere three years. The scientist's ominous calculation, though shrouded in mystery, sends shivers down the spine. If the Thing too takes place years after the original, it must address whether humanity has fallen victim to the thing's insidious assimilation, or if there's hope for our species. As we eagerly await the potential resurrection of John Carpenter's The Thing 2, let us cherish the lingering mysteries that have fueled our imaginations for so long. For it is in the unknown, in the shadows of uncertainty, that true cosmic horror thrives. And when the sequel finally arrives, May it bring the answers that satisfy our insatiable curiosity while honouring the legacy of its predecessor. Amen. Everything we know so far, cast and release date. So here's everything we know about John Carpenter's highly anticipated The Thing 2. Now, don't get too excited, because unfortunately there isn't an exact release date to circle on the calendars. But fear not, my intrepid horror enthusiasts, as we can tentatively set our sights on a spine-shilling 2025 release. And that gives us plenty of time to stock up on popcorn and fortify our nerves. And now onto the burning question of the hour, who will grace the screen in this long-awaited sequel? While the official cast is still a well-guarded secret, let's unleash our imaginations and indulge in some speculative casting, shall we? Picture this, a dream team of popular horror movie actors stepping into the icy boots of the characters we know and love. For the role of MacReady, the rugged and resourceful survivor, who better than our beloved horror icon Bruce Campbell? With his devilish charm and a chainsaw in hand, Campbell could effortlessly capture MacReady's grizzled determination while serving up a healthy dose of humour. As for Childs, the enigmatic companion whose loyalty is as frosty as the Antarctic winds, I can't help but imagine Idris Elba bringing his magnetic presence to the role. Idris Elba's intensity and undeniable charisma will keep us guessing until the final frame, just as the character demands. And let's not forget the rest of the crew. We need a brilliant ensemble to navigate the treacherous depths of this cosmic horror. So how about Emily Blunt 
as the tenacious scientist who unravels the secrets of the thing. Blunt's talent for portraying strong, multifaceted characters could make her a perfect fit for that role. And let's not overlook the obligatory wildcard character who adds an extra layer of intrigue. For this, we shall cast the incomparable Lapita Nyong'o. Known for her ability to captivate audiences with her range and versatility, she could inject both vulnerability and strength into an enigmatic figure, leaving us on the edge of our seats. Now, keep in mind, these are just flights of fancy, products of our eager anticipations. The actual casting choices may surprise us in ways we can't fathom, just like the hidden depths of the Thing itself. But, my horror-loving comrades, as we eagerly await the release of the Thing too, let's keep our hopes high, our thermometers low, and our imaginations running wild. Whether it is Bruce Campbell, Idris Elba, Emily Blunt, Lupita Nyong'o, or a different constellation of stars, let us trust the vision of John Carpenter and his team to bring us a chilling sequel that will both terrify and thrill. Until then, prepare yourself for a frosty 2025 because things are going to get seriously chilly. Marvelous Verdict In the realm of cinematic anticipation, few projects have generated as much excitement and fervor as The Thing 2. For years, fans of John Carpenter's horror masterpiece have yearned for a continuation, a chance to delve deeper into the icy abyss and unlock the enigmas left unresolved. And now, as the whispers grow louder and the winds carry a promise of a sequel, the excitement among devoted followers is reaching a fever pitch. The enduring legacy of The Thing has spanned decades, captivating new audiences with its taut storytelling, unforgettable creature effects, and the palpable sense of dread that lingers long after the credits roll. The devoted fanbase has tirelessly dissected every frame, debated every theory, and yearned for closure. The announcement of The Thing 2 ignites a spark of hope, a glimmer of possibility that we may finally witness the next chapter in this chilling saga. As we stand at the precipice of this much-awaited project, the anticipation is electric, the air crackles with excitement, and discussions amongst fans intensify as they share their speculations and hopes for what lies ahead. Will the sequel live up to its predecessor's legacy? Can it unravel the remaining mysteries and deliver an experience that resonates deep within our bones? While we await the frost-bitten arrival of The Thing 2, let us revel in the joy of possibility. Let us celebrate the dedication and passion of the fans who kept the flame burning all these years. And let us embrace the anticipation, for it is in these moments of eager expectation that the magic of cinema truly comes alive. And so, my fellow enthusiasts, hold tight to your parkas, keep your eyes peeled for any updates, and brace yourselves for the chilling journey that lies ahead. The thing too beckons, promising to deliver an experience that will thaw our hearts freeze our breath and remind us once again why this story is a timeless gem in the realm of horror. The countdown has begun. The excitement is palpable. Prepare yourselves for a frostbitten thrill like no other. Let us know in the comments down below what theories you have about the thing too. And if you liked the video, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button on your way out. Until next time, have a good one folks. Be safe.